Tonight, the final chapter to a story you'll see only on two. A man convicted of intentionally infecting his ex-girlfriend with HIV learned his sentence earlier today. Channel 2 Investigates broke this story back in 2016. Investigator Robert Arnold in the newsroom now with reaction from the woman whose life was forever changed by this crime. Robert. Yeah, Sarita Anderson has waited two years for this day. In 2016, she contacted Channel 2 Investigates after testing positive for HIV and suspecting her ex-boyfriend infected her intentionally. Sarita Anderson took the stand, making a victim impact statement against the man she says she once loved, the man who she now says destroyed her life. The catastrophic chain of events that led me like to down spiral while I had to dig myself out of that hole and basically I feel like the old me died. Her ex-boyfriend Karim Tyson Zahakani pleaded guilty to aggravated assault of a family member with serious bodily injury. Prosecutors say he knowingly infected Sarita with HIV. We first brought you Sarita's story in 2016. After that, other women came forward. At least eight. Some of them had pictures, some had videos, and he was either going, even going by another name. Two of the women who reached out to Sarita sat side by side with her today in court as the judge sentenced Zahakani to 30 years in prison. Zahakani will receive credit for time served, and Sarita says she can finally close this chapter of her life. But she still worries there are more victims out there and has this message for them. You are the only person that can keep yourself safe. Don't depend on your life is yours to protect. Anderson says with medication and treatment, she's been able to keep her viral load low. And for now, the virus is not detectable in her system. Live in the newsroom, Robert Arnold, KPRC, Channel 2 News.